let's protect your network okay let's mitigate your VLAN attack, DHCP, IRP and spawning tree attack <coughs> okay guys we use uh, Cisco best practice in this way uh, let's start okay I will create three VLANs VLAN 10 VLAN 20 and VLAN 999 okay. VLAN 10 for uh, VLAN 10 and 20 for my local network and 999 for <coughs> native VLAN and uh, we will assign unused port in 999 VLAN for unused traffic okay interface fast Ethernet 01 always use static access port for PCs or end devices always switch port mode access switch port access VLAN 10 okay and interface fast Ethernet 02 switch port mode access and switch port access VLAN 20 okay we have two VLANs let's create our trunk port interface gigabit 01 switch port mode trunk switch port trunk allow it to VLAN 10 20 and 999 so <coughs> Cisco recommend disable DTP protocol it's enabled by default let's disable switch port no negotiate excellent now DTP protocol is disabled let's configure router okay we will use sub interfaces for this enable comt interface gigabit 00, zero. no shutdown okay interface gigabit 00, zero dot 10 for vlan 10 encapsulation dot 1q 10 ip address 192.168.0.1 and 24 subnet mask. Okay. Same for VLAN 20. Okay, 20. IP address dot one dot one. Oops, I forget the encapsulation dot one to twenty. And okay, let's configure link connected DHCP server interface gigabit 01 IP address 10, uh, 10 0, 0, 1. <coughs> no shit. Excellent. <coughs> Cisco recommend disable all unused interfaces. Okay, let's verify show interface status. Oops. Show interface status. Okay, I have used fast Ethernet 0, 1 and 2 and other port not usable so we will shut down these ports and assign unused VLAN 999 okay Conf interface range fast Ethernet 0 0 24 okay shut down and switch port mode access switch port access VLAN 999 Okay, this is best practice. Excellent. <clears throat> uh, 
let's configure the HTTP. The HTTP server. Let's assign IP address 10.0.0.254. Okay, slash 24 and gateway 10001. Okay, let's verify connection. Excellent. Let's enable the HCP service. First of service put on and assign default gateway 01. Then a server, a date, our lovely server. And one nine two one six eight zero for example nine. The RCP will start dynamic addressing in this range. Okay, twenty four. Let's add save. Okay, we have configured one pool. Let's create second. For VLAN 20, I will change only this. Okay. Now we can change then a server also. <coughs> Excellent. Let's add. Service is on. Okay, let's verify the ACP. Yes, I forget the sign helper address. <laughs> this is my mistake. So we interface gigabit 00.10 IP helper IP helper address 10.0.0.254. This is IP address DHCP server. Okay, because our DHCP server is another network, not in the same. PC. Excellent. Let's try again. Cool. It's work. Second one for VLAN 20. Excellent. 1.9. And DNS server 8844. Excellent. Let's mitigate the HCP attacks. Okay. First of all, we will enable IP DHCP spoofing. Okay, in our switch, config interface fast is on at zero one. Okay, IP DHCP snooping limit rate. Six packet per second. Oops. Limit rate. Limit rate six. Excellent. And zero. Okay. IP DHCP is in pink. Le limit rate six. Okay. And we will. Trust this trunk port gigabit zero one for the HCP replies interface gigabit zero one IP DCP snooping trust. So let's let's verify show IP DCP snooping. Okay, we have one gigabit zero one. Trusted port, yes, and rate limit bit per seconds. Oh, sorry, packet per seconds unlimited. Excellent. Now we uh, now our now our switch will uh, accept reply only this gigabit zero one port only. 
This scenario will protect your network to attacks, the IP DHCP spoofing and IP DHCP starvations. Yes, DHCP spoofing and starvations attack. Excellent. Let's globally enable it, this IP DHCP spoofing for VLAN 10 and 20. Oops. Or VLAN 10 and 20. Excellent. Okay, let's try for this ARP method. ARP, we will protect it with dynamic ARP inspection. So let's create in interfaces interface faster than 01 IP ARP inspection trust sorry IP ARP inspection trust. trust and for faster than 02 excellent Gigabit 01 IP ARP inspection trust. Excellent. Let's enable globally uh, in configuration mode IP ACP. Oh, sorry, IP. Yes, IP. Uh, the ACP will choose it and IP dynamic. IPRP inspection for VLANs 10, 20 and IPRP inspection validate with source, destination and IP addresses. Okay. And last one, let's choose spawning tree mitigation for our PCs interface fast Ethernet 0 1 I spawn tree port fast enable absorb port fast and for 0 2 Spawning tree port fast. And we will enable in these two ports spawning tree BPDU guard interface fast is one spawning tree BPDU guard enable. Tree BPD guard enable. When we assign spawning tree port fast command uh, import, they will many uh, syslogs. This is warning, so we will choose BPD guard enable for protecting BPD packets coming in switch okay we also can enable this for globally spawning tree bpdu what bpdu sorry spawning tree or first uh, default default yes you can choose and Spawning tree, port fast, PPDU guard, default command. <coughs> Excellent. Now we are protected and secured. Thanks for watching. See you.